Once you travel the world, all the spaces inside your heart. Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're going to kind of do a light cleaning here in my living room. I'm gonna put away any summer decor that I have. Um, thinking I might change up my pillow covers. Definitely this wreath is gonna be put away. Um, yeah, kind of gonna leave it as a clean slate so when I am ready to decorate for fall, I'll be good to go. So I know a lot of people don't wanna hear about fall yet, but I don't mind it, I'm excited. Fall is my favorite season. My favorite season to decorate as well. So I'm excited. But anyway, um, if you haven't seen my pre-fall decorating coffee bar video, I will link that below. Um, no pumpkins were involved <laughs> and no pumpkins will be involved today either. Like I said, I'm just leaving it as a clean slate so I will be ready to go in a couple of weeks. Um, if you're new, welcome. My name is Adriana and I usually do videos like decorate with me videos, um, haul videos, shop with me videos. So if you like videos like that, please consider subscribing to my channel. And if you are coming back, welcome back. I also wanted to mention in my last video, it's uh, a Dollar Tree Halloween haul video that I did. There's also a giveaway in that video, so if you guys are interested, go check out the video, comment in that video, and also follow me over on Instagram to be entered to win the giveaway. So yeah, let me stop talking now and let's get right into the video. I like to start over here by my sofa table. I've talked about this area before, obviously. It serves for decor purposes, but it also serves as extra storage space. I store a lot of my seasonal wreaths underneath this table and some other decor items that I don't have space for in my closets. I really like these faux white books. I got them from Deco Created. It's a decor subscription box. And um, yeah, if you can tell, I switched them, I flipped them over, excuse me, um, so the wording wouldn't show. And I plan on wrapping them with some pretty fall ribbon for the fall. So yeah, I'll probably be sharing that over on Instagram. So make sure you're following me on Instagram if you aren't already. And I decided to just DIY real quick, real simple, this wreath to put on my window pane. After I took down the tulip wreath, it just looked way too bare. So I just put this together real quick just to have something there until I decorate for fall.
And here are my sunflowers that I thought I was going to put over on my coffee bar, but they were just way too big for that little area. So I just decided to put them here and they look so much better here in this side of the living room with the rest of my faux plants. <laughs> um, actually, that plant over here on the right is real and I have kept it alive. I'm very proud of myself because I do not have a green thumb at all, but I've managed to keep that plant alive. Now I wanted to change my pillow covers to the ones that I had last year. I had like this burnt orange pillow covers for these pillows, but I couldn't find them. I think they are put away with my fall decor and I really didn't feel like opening up my tub. So pillow covers are going to have to wait for now. I really don't like having my love seat over here on this wall, but we have to leave it here for now because the air conditioner is on the other side and it would cover it. But once the cooler temps come and the air conditioner goes off, we will be putting this love seat back on the other side. So I thought I was going to leave the decor in the lantern as is and not change it until I was ready to decorate for fall, but I do end up switching it up. So you'll see that in a little bit. And you're also gonna see that I'm adding a new tray that I found at Hobby Lobby. I love this tray. I have the larger version of it in my dining room and I just, when I saw the smaller version, I said, this is perfect for my coffee bar. So I'm just going to add this candle holder that I DIY'd along with a little faux plant. And that's it, just keeping it really simple. Um, but I did wanna switch it up because I have had my coffee table styled the same for a really long time. So just a small little change, but it does make a little bit of a difference for me. Um, and yeah, I like the way it came out. These decorative, um, I guess you'd call them like fillers. Uh, they're from Frazzleberries. It's a store that I've talked about in Warwick, New York. We love it there. Um, yeah, so that's it. Just kept it simple, but at the same time switched it up so it wouldn't look the same. <laughs> Thank you. 
and here i'm just switching things up i'm gonna put away the glass vases for now i had this yellow one um, stored away um, i thought it was a good transitional piece to have out here on my console table and yeah um, i opted to take out the stems and just leave it bare So these pillows I bought last year from walmart.com. They were like 12 bucks for the both of them. Um, but obviously I'm not ready for the fall decor just yet. So all I did was just flip them over and nobody would know the difference. <laughs> and this candle is also from the store Frazzleberries. It smells so good because what's a clean with me video without lighting up a candle, right? <laughs> So, um, oh, don't mind the TV. At this point, I was listening to some good Christian worship music. Um, but yeah. And here I'm looking at this sign that I bought from the Target Dollar Spot. It's in interchangeable um, signs. So I was just trying to see if there was another one that I can use. But I just kept the welcome home one. The other phrases were all fall related. And I want to show you guys this. Uh, garland that I got on clearance from Walmart. It's gorgeous. I know this garland is more of like a summer uh, greenery, but I do plan on DIYing it and adding fall leaves and pumpkins and all the good stuff. So it's just such a pretty garland and it's so full. So I don't think it's going to matter and I don't think you're going to see much of it anyway after I'm done DIYing it. And lastly, I wanted to just do a quick little centerpiece with my new picture. Bought this picture also on clearance from TJ Maxx. Um, and yeah, this wheat and these sunflowers are from last year. The sunflowers are from Dollar Tree. I can't believe how beautiful they still look. Um, so this was just a bundle that I never got to use last year. So I'm just using it now. And the wheat, I also used it last year. And there you go. Little quick centerpiece decor. And um, I'm going to give you a little overview of my coffee bar in case you haven't seen my video on how I decorated it. Um, it's the sunflower and apple theme pre-fall decor. <laughs> so this is it for the video um sorry if you hear the air conditioner um but yep so as you can see i still have to put something on the scale but i didn't want to because i know that i'm going to be putting pumpkins more than likely so i'm just kind of leaving it clean slate i did decorate a little bit i wanted to put a reef up there on the window pane because i didn't like it looked way too bare without it and yep as you saw switched up a little bit the coffee table and let me swing you around slowly um you saw i put the sunflowers just to give it a pop of color there and then here kind of kept it simple as well by the way <laughs> my baby girls college picture i had her high school one there i had told you guys i was gonna switch it up and i did i finally got it and yeah so that's gonna stay out there for a few more weeks but yeah so then i ended up putting this little branch of um leaves here i think it looks cute you know just for now with the candle just to kind of not leave it bare I added that little ladder. I love that little ladder. I bought it last year. Um, so I took it out again. And I just left the vase empty for now. I'm not sure if I'm gonna leave it out with my fall decor, but for now I just left it there to, again for some color, but also kind of transition into fall. And yeah, um, what I do need to get is a fall blanket i don't have one so for now i'm gonna leave this blanket just there and as i showed you guys the garland i really can't wait to see how it looks when i um put the 
when I put the fall leaves and I'm gonna, you know, put a whole bunch of stuff just to kind of spruce it up. But yeah, I love this garland. I love it. I can't believe I got in such a great deal. Um, yeah, so that's it for today. Hope I gave you guys some inspiration to clean a little bit and get ready for fall.